My friends, welcome back. We are playing Star Trek New Horizons into the mirror darkly. I've not said this for a while. Uh, we're playing as the United Earth transformed in the United Federation of Planets. And we entered the Brim Wars uh, in a previous episode. It's going to be messy. I'm going to be loving it. We are having two fleets in the Kardashian Union. We're going to be trying to uh, annul all of this. And then slowly work our way. And go in from the back with the Brim this will be a bit messy, the brain is, is, is... The fleet power is inferior, but they can still do a lot of damage. And that would increase the amount of time in the war. Integration of the Kobali Republic over here is about to be done, giving us even more territory, more stuff to do. Some fleets that we are we, we going to get in here, we're going to be removing, since I just don't want to deal with that. Cannon fire rate has just increased the research speed. That is so nice. What does this do? A new component. Tracking plus 8. Oh, sweet. That is really sweet. Veteran overload jammer. There's some really cool options in here. There really is. We're going for the additional research. And also, I hope to get a leader lifespan plus 15, because some of my leaders are going to get, well, quite old. The Galaxy class flagship is at 60%, and I would really like to have it enter at least the war with disclaiming some systems. I think a Baseball Boy could really, really use, well, something to do, mainly. So, the second fleet. Come on. Yeah, oh, you, you're also fighting this, huh? I don't care about that. The hostile fleets is getting a bit annoying. Forward fleet not doing anything. These guys are going in. Oh, sweet. That's almost everything they have. Yeah, this is going to be a fight. Oh, yeah, I like it. There you go. Let's go and deal with the Bream. Could we, could we, could you go? Oh, they are moving. Yeah, it felt like the stations were just moving. So how many ships? We got three, three, three. Um, you know what we haven't done in a long ass time? And just have a tiny bit of a look here. Okay, let's uh, let's let's zoom in even more. Oh, that's really fast. Let's slow down the time. So you got the ambassador class fighting, and he's just standing still. He, I think he's on on the line, like a ship of the line, because he's not moving. Okay, let's zoom out. I don't want to uh, ruin everyone's ears yet. I'll, I'll do that later, another time. So, you are back. Yeah, let's upgrade you. You are healing. And, of course, let's deal with this. It's actually quite close to the border. So, we will allow you to go in with the Cardassians over here. Like I said, we want to get those out ASAP. My allies will most likely be able to deal with the Bream. Uh, here's another fight with the, uh, the Kardashians going in. And you'll probably be reinforced already. Okay, let's speed the game up. And slowly work our way to clearing out these... Uh, He's maimed. Mad Dacker is maimed. I really do not like that event. I really do not like that event. Uh, off camera, I've built more uh, food and more minerals. Rescue mission. It's a country event, apparently. Let's research this, because I should have done so. Where is this? Yeah, I can't do this. It's over there. It's like in Borg territory. Who are we now are still superior. Continue the mission. Yo, man, I can't wait until this fight starts going. And we'll, we will see some some scary, scary, scary fleets. 
Uh, because I really think the Borg is, is really scary. There we go. The third fleet has been upgraded. And they are... Once again, getting way too much. Why? Mm. Yeah, it's at full strength, but it can never join. Actually, it can. Interesting. But... I uh, will not let it go for that. Where are those annoying fleets? Because we're going to be dealing with some of these fleets. He is about to lose a lot of their fleets. Actually, let's go over there. Everyone's fighting. It's going to take forever to get these planets under control though. Hostile fleet encountered. Hostile fleet encountered. What's all of this? Association status has ended with the uh, Golden Concord. Okay, that's fine. Uh, it, it, it. I would be surprised if they didn't. We are ready. Encountered. They're receptive. That's that's cool because they're at war, so. Yeah, there's little they can do. Integration is almost done. We'll get uh, 10 more influence, which is not helping us at all. We're taking back this system and then just jumping over to Valeria. Apparently we found something else over here. Still way too much influence to deal with that. So, let's see. Third Fleet is heading towards that. And the Bream is slowly being pushed out. The Bream Fleet is just too tiny. Yo. There's a 10k over there. And there's a 5k. So, we'll go over there. I wish I could see the lines. I know it's, it's not how the Federation would work, but... Um, it, it would make it easier in some situations to deal with the enemy presence. So where does the 5th fleet stay? Where, where are you going? Come on. Let's see. Hostile fleet encountered. Oh, it's getting Hostile really close. Encountered. Some galaxy classes in there. That's going to be so nice. Let's uh, increase. I don't want to reinforce any fleet that is currently fighting. That's usually a bad idea. Look at this go in the Badlands. Yeah, let's go. The Mouse Senti will definitely take on. Uh, my fleets are uh, over here. So... Oh, the game's lagging. We'll get ourselves another general. It's been a, a long-ass time. Army morale. Yeah, let's let's get this guy in there. Share like female. More morale. And look at that. We're, we're driving up the war exhaust quite a bit. Negative 767. So, yeah, it's it's not a tiny war. And um, this is what I like about on Stellaris. Still, also what I like about... Who the hell are you? Oh, the integration is done. That's what's going on. Well, I don't need you. Go away. You as well. We have a buttload of systems. So we want to stay, we want to keep some systems over here because they're close with the Borg. So you, Kellis, you will be... <sighs> well, we could make it a Bastion or whatever, they just don't need to attack us. That's a bit of a thing, right? So some of you are still making ships. Let's get rid of that. But a shipyard would be nice. Not at the front lines, though. 
I think Bastion wouldn't be such a bad idea. Yeah. We are upgrading you. And we'll deal with you later. You. You're nice and centered, so we'll keep you. When So we need something that deals with trade value. Although there's not as much as I'd hoped. Callus, uh, a weapon battery, then... I don't know, like like trading station and shipyard? Shipyard over here. How many can we get? 30. We had 28, so we can only do two stations. So one over here, one over there. You. Go. You. Kelly will remain. You. Go away. We'll keep you. Also, no system apart from this guy over here, but we don't need one over there. We could use one over here for the trade value. Okay, almost. Okay, so we can keep one base over here. I'll keep this one. And the reason for it, it it's probably going to take them a lot longer to take this station. And I'm... I'm a lot longer, he says. Yeah, that's a bloody joke. Um, we all know that um, once this starts, it's going to be horrible and actually we already have a shipyard in here this is a, uh, a shipyard because this is starbase what starbase 14 this is a dedicated shipyard so we don't necessarily need one over here uh, we are going to be sending well hmm the area in between here is is annoying demon 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 we'll deal with this uh, after the war not right now so for now let us just um, make you into a naval depot I will keep the science so this will just go into the star bases it doesn't affect me as much because I just don't see it yeah this should be well uh, we got more minerals which is quite nice we did have a drop in alloys We'll get our influence back next tick, which is quite nice. We got now have 3k over here. And he's going to be fighting, you're going to be busy. Construction complete. Let's see. You, not doing anything. Go here, go there, go to Cadesia. Fort Fleet, you're in here. Not doing anything, of course. There is a, uh, a large fleet in there, so let's go and assist. And we'll, we're just focusing on the larger fleets. And hopefully the fifth fleet is going to be showing up anytime soon. I think they're actually being built over here. Uh, we're on 71% with the, uh, the, the newest Enterprise. Yeah, they lost uh, a ship. Ah, oh, damn. Uh, here we go. The fifth fleet. Finally. So where are you standing? Over there. You know what? We'll, um, we'll keep having you there. And you can deal with uh, this fleet. Okay, so it's clenched. That's good. Okay, third fleet's not doing anything. Go here. And the rest is still moving, so that's good. Yeah, they were a, a, a subject, right? So they probably just don't have as much as the rest. And I think they're out of the war really, really soon. We do have to make sure that we get all of the systems. Because they will start building new stations and it, that's just going to be annoying. We'll leave this. Because it's part of one of the fleets that is most likely fighting right now. Uh, 
Uh, victory is ours. It's not of the second fleet. Would it be of the third then? Insult, we don't care about. Sticks and stones, man. Sticks and stones. Hmm. Yeah, where is that one from? It is an ambassador class, right? A galaxy class. Oh, it's the one from here. We need to get rid of an Excelsior class so we can actually join. And this is the third fleet. Hostile fleet encountered. Hmm. Let us transfer. Let us transfer. Yes, again, Excelsior class. Uh, we can actually merge you with the 5th fleet before we start deleting ships. Now you can actually be merged. Let's change this. It's stone free now, so that's good. So, 5th fleet and 7th merge together. Now we should get rid of one of those Excelsior classes. I think we're building all of the ships. So, let's get rid of you it should be enough no this is a lie to wait until all of the ships merge you go there and deal with this uh this 15k yeah they're almost out of their navy um i was losing my bearings there for a second We have to go to Drian. Can we can we please game just just hold on hold on we'll we'll get there. You're done. Uh that's very kind of you, but I really want you to deal with that with that fleet. Complete. War has broken out. War has broken out between the Dozai and the uh, Karash Third Imperium. Let's uh, build you up. Mining station lost. Um, that's fine. It's a bit of a um, annoying thing to deal with um, attacking mining stations. Construction complete. We had a research. Actually, the research agreement with the Bream and the Cardassians has broken. Which is interesting. Energy is going down. Okay. Why not? Technology discovered. What do we get? Leader lifespan. Amazing. I like that. Adaptil um, adaptable. Adaptable. Interesting. Let's get the war exhaust gain negative twenty. Oh, they're sending in everything then. They are. They are going to be sending everything. Will they be in time? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, how long will it go? How long? Until they start jumping in. Because this could be a pretty, pretty nasty fight. 21k and then against um, about... 25 can go both ways station did fell which is quite nice so they're now down to about 11 and they jumped out Hostile fleet encountered. and that's very unfortunate i was kind of hoping to get more out of this okay you go there kardashians are almost done uh, we will have to deal with the Badlands. As you can see, there's no 
No little pointy ends on this. So there's a planet. And we will go and take it. So you. Land those armies. There's actually three planets in here. Wow. How many armies? Whoa. Oh wow. Damn. Damn. What the hell? No armies over there. Okay, well, first things first. You, you go take and land over there. <laughs> Damn. That's, uh... Those armies, guys. What the hell? Construction complete. And if we can get our war score up from the Kardashians and their other empires, the Bream is just not going to be as annoying. You, first fleet, not doing anything. Why is that? Go there. That fight is done. Actually, just go to the Kardashians. And you are going to help over there. Go take that station back. Colony founded. Yes, colony founded. Because that's what you do in the middle of war. Found colonies, guys. 17k we can store. And the three-year mission is completed. We're almost there with the 81% on the galaxy class. Yeah, and we, all of these ships still need to go in. We don't have to merge up. At least I don't think so. One ship needs to be uh, built up. I don't think so. I think one is still moving over there. And as long as it is, we're not changing it. Commercial pack invitation is broken, but not with us. And yes, we are landing. Well, you can do. Yeah, you go deal with that. You go over here. And the Kardashians are almost out. Four fleet. You're not doing anything. Well, there's a 14k fighting next to you. Uh, we'll have to take these two planets so they won't start building up again. At least not at the same rate. Because the larger stations produce the most ships. Which, well, makes a lot of sense, right? 116 planets. This is getting... Fleet oh, stop with the hostile fleets. It's transports. Technology discovered. New technology. Research speed plus 5. Subspace weapons, uh, let's leave this until after the war. Colony development speed, but also migration. Mm. Let's go with the power core. Since it's an upgrade for at least a ship. Construction complete. Everything is getting in here again. Yeah, as you can see there, they're just... Pulling back towards their system. They're not even advancing at the moment. They are pulling back. Because they need to deal with this fleet. And we're finally matched. We made it towards their um, the Kardashian borders. Did we take the planet? We're about to. This is the first one that has no armies. Uh, the others are going to be a big ass pain to deal with. And we'll lose a lot of trips. And that's why I usually want to leave the planets to my allies. Because I think it's the most annoying thing to deal with. So land armies here. And we'll see the outcome of that in the next episode guys. The Kardashians are almost out. And it's we'll just have to deal with the, uh, the small fries. And then just head over in here. This war is probably going to take 5 episodes. 5 or 6. But this is the one that we need once this is done, it is only the Tamarian unity in the entire galaxy apart from the Borg. That's annoying. Also, if the Borg would go to war with one of my allies, maybe we could see what it's all about. I have a feeling that they want to get towards the, um, the wormhole leading to Bajor territories. But we'll just have to see how that goes. Also, we're building up the 5th fleet, so we're busy. Fendoma states are no longer having a defensive pack, which is okay. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Have a good one.